Hello boys and girls, how are you? I hope you're having a good day. Uh, last class I promised that we were going to make the video shorter. So let's begin. Make sure you're, you are in your student books, page 103. And let's start. Exercise A, it says, look at the title. What do you think the title means? Let's look at the title. Dinosaurs Alive. Alive means vivos, so dinosaurs vivos. So are dinosaurs alive right now? No, of course not, they're extinct. So now let's look at the picture. Is that a real dinosaur? Of course not. So if we read right here, it says a model dinosaur is being carried on a car in New York, USA. Why do you think this man is carrying the dinosaur on his car. All right, let's continue. Exercise B, it says skim the text, choose a different title. Remember guys, skim means to scan, scanear. So when you scan a text, it's not necessary to read every single word from the text. And it's also not necessary to understand everything in the story. Right now, you're just going to scan as if you were looking for a, like how you say in Spanish, sopa de letras, a word search. Okay, guys, so let's look at the options. Option A says dinosaur hunters. Option B, Tyler licensed discoveries. And option C, dinosaurs and the movies. So let's go to the text. Make sure to pause the video, scan the text, and when you are finished, play the video again. Now that you have scanned the text, the correct answer is option C. All right, option C. Dinosaurs and the movies. But let's see, what made you choose option C? What made you choose option C? Underline all the parts that made you underline option C at the movies. All right, for me, it was in this paragraph, the first paragraph. It talks about the Jurassic Park movies and the Jurassic Park. Have you seen the Jurassic Park movies? Okay, guys, let's go to the next exercise. It says, read the text, underline the words that describe body parts. Again, Go back to the text and look for words that describe body parts. I'll help you with some examples and then you can do it by yourself. All right, guys, now that you have paused the video, I will show you which words are the correct ones. Here it's bone, bones, teeth. skin, skin, and flesh. Again, skin, feathers, tail, and skeleton. So check your answers to see if you are correct. All right, guys. So now before we go to the next page, I want you, I have a little challenge for you. I want you to put these sentences in your notebook, write them down, and I want you to use the text and put them in the correct order. What happened first? All right. So I'll help you with the first one. What happened first? Filmmakers made Jurassic Park. Dinosaurs lived on Earth. People watched Jurassic Park. Filmmakers from the movie. Or E, paleontologists discover how dinosaurs probably hunted. Well, obviously, guys, the first thing that occurred is letter B. Dinosaurs lived on Earth. Yes, it is obvious because the dinosaurs lived a long, long, long time ago. All right, guys, now pause the video, 
put the sentences in the correct order and when you play I will show you what is the correct order of the sentences. Okay guys, I hope you're finished. So let me tell you what is the correct answer. After dinosaurs lived on Earth, what happened? If you put D, filmmakers from the movie Jurassic Park study fossils, you are correct. Yes, first they studied them before they made the movie. All right, that's number two. Now, let's see what happened after that. If you put A, filmmakers made Jurassic Park, then you are correct. First, they studied the fossils and then they made the movie. All right. And number four, the correct answer is yes, letter C. People watch Jurassic World at the movie theaters. That happened next. All right. And finally, exercise, well, I'm oh, sorry, letter A, paleontologists discover how dinosaurs probably hunted. That was the final one. All right, guys. So I hope you were correct. Now we're ready to go to the next page. Okay, guys, make sure you are in page 104 for the next activity. All right. Now, comprehension. Here in exercise A, we're going to answer some questions. Okay, guys, but first we have to find what type of questions there are. For example, number one, it says detail. Detail means detalladamente. So that means you have to read carefully, okay? That the answer is going to be exactly how it is here in the questions. Number two, reference. That means referencia. En este caso, ¿a qué hace referencia la palabra them? Okay. Next, main idea. Number three, main idea. What does that mean? La idea principal. Entonces, no vas a saber la idea principal si no lees todo el texto. Entonces, es muy importante que leas todo el texto, niños. Okay. The next word or the next question is vocabulary. This is a vocabulary type question. Eso significa que simple, simplemente tienes que saber qué significa esta palabra, animate. Y todos estos son sinónimos. Bueno, uno de ellos es un sinónimo. And finally, boys and girls, detail. Again, the detail questions, las preguntas de detalle, son las preguntas que vas a encontrar en, el, en la lectura tal cual. Por ejemplo, si la respuesta sería A, entonces en el texto vas a encontrar la respuesta así, tal cual. All right, guys, this is the time where you pause the video and when you press play, we are going to check the answers together. Okay, guys, let's go to the first exercise. It says, which statement is not true about fossils? Okay, guys, so let's use a, the first paragraph to find the answers. It all starts here with Lyson. Lyson says the best way to learn about dinosaurs is to look at the fossils. Fossils and footprints help scientists understand how dinosaurs looked, moved, and lived. And the second one, there are fossils of bones and teeth in rocks, lava, and ice. All right, guys, so here, by reading the first paragraph, we know that the correct answer is letter C. Do filmmakers dig for different types of fossils? No. The scientists are the ones that dig for the fossils, not the filmmakers. Filmmakers are the ones that make the movies. Let's go to exercise two now. Here it says, in line five, what does them refer to? So this is very easy. We just have to go to line five. Hmm. So how do filmmakers bring them to life? How do filmmakers bring them to life? 
For that, boys and girls, we have to go back. Here, in all Jurassic Park movies, from Jurassic Park to Jurassic World, dinosaurs are the star of the show. The way dinosaurs look, move and roar is amazing. So here, we know that we are talking about dinosaurs, yes? They, the dinosaurs, seem to be real. But dinosaurs haven't lived, no han vivido, in our planet for the last 65 years. So how do fi filmmakers bring them to life? So what are the people talking about when we say them? That's right, boys and girls. So them refers to the dinosaurs. Great job, guys. Let's go to exercise three. What is the main idea of the third paragraph? Here it's telling us exactly where to go. So let's go to the third paragraph. Remember, guys, main idea means la idea principal. So we have to read all of third paragraph. Okay. So what is the main idea? Let's read it together. Filmmakers use fossils and other research from paleontologists to build dinosaur for their movies. But they have to use their imaginations too. When a paleontologist discover a fossil, the animal skin and flesh, su piel, have usually disappeared. The dinosaur builders have to ask a lot of questions. What color was the dinosaur skin? Did it used to have stripes or other patterns on its body? Did it used to have feathers? Solían tener plumas. How long was its tail? Y cuánto medía su cola? All right, so let's go back to the question. The main idea. We were talking about all the body parts. So what was the main idea? Filmmakers use research and their imagination. Fossils aren't always complete. Or paleontologists don't know what color dinosaurs were. Okay, although B and C are correct, boys and girls, that is not the main idea of paragraph three. No es la idea principal. The main idea, boys and girls, is filmmakers use research and their imaginations. Okay, let's go to exercise four. What is another word for animate? Here, we can look for the word animate in our dictionary. So what is it? Move, use, or scan? The correct answer is move. All right. It says look in line 25. So here we can see that it says CGI computer generated imagery to animate them, make them move. Yes, make the dinosaurs move. Let's go back. And finally, number five, what do scientists not know for certain about dinosaurs? How big they were, when they lived on Earth, or how they hunted? Remember, guys, that detail means detalle. So we have to read with detail, detalladamente. So let's go to the final paragraph. Here we can see that it says word by word, how did they hunt? Yes, that refers to paleontologists still have a lot of questions. Aún tienen muchas preguntas. Y una de esas es, how they hunted. Como cazaban. So for here, boys and girls, the correct answer is letter C. Excellent, guys. Letter C, how they hunted. Okay, guys, we're finished for today. The homework for the next class is going to be page... 105 it's going to be our homework you are going to have to watch a video so look at the in the drive in the drive i will upload the video that you have to watch to answer the questions okay and we will check the homework the next class okay guys i promised i wasn't going to make it that long so i hope it wasn't too long for you guys and remember, homework, page 105. I'm going to be uploading it in the Google Drive. It's going to be a video about page 105. Okay, guys, do the homework and we'll check in the next class. I hope you have a nice day. Bye.